amigos. Can't really look at the camera. Hello, I'll say hello. Hello, um, but I'm driving. I am so excited and happy because there's a dog that I noticed about six months ago that he's in need. He, he has a back leg that doesn't really work. Um, probably needs to be amputated. Um, but at the time, the shelter that I work with couldn't take him. They were just full. There were so many puppies this last uh, summer. So finally the shelter has room for him and he's much worse off now. I'll put a picture here. I saw him the other day. Oh my God, he's so thin. So the shelter has room for him. So tomorrow I'm gonna rescue him. But today I'm just gonna try to find him. I hope I can find him. I didn't see him earlier. And I'm gonna feed him and then at least know where he is. Tomorrow my wonderful vet um, can take him. And so he's going to be in the vet's care. This vet is wonderful, has space to keep, um, I'm going to call him Max. Let's call him Max, uh, this dog. So Max will be able to stay there, heal, get whatever treatment he needs, and then there's room for the shelter. And I am going to be on the lookout for someone who is tender hearted for a three legged dog. Guys, I'm on the side of the road here and this little one was in the middle of the road. Oh my gosh, my heart just breaks. So, I don't know. Anyway, we're getting her some food. So I gotta pull away without the dog running into the road. This is really hard. Um, emotionally, I really struggle. I wanna help every dog, you can't. You can't, you just have to pick and choose, which is awful. Um, but I'm on the side of the road, a little bit away from where I think he is, but uh, I can get back home out of here more easily. So let's see what we can do. Hola bonita. Hi, sweetie. Hi, sweetie. Oh wait, is this your daughter? Oh, you're mama and daughter, aren't you? Oh, is that the daddy? Oh, sweetheart. No, no, mama, stay here. Oh my God, you guys, look, look how close we are to the road. This the one, but I found Max. We found him. I'm so relieved I found him. You'll be enough for me. I give you my heart, my love, you see. You're all I'll ever need. You're all I'll ever need. So the re relief I feel is immense. Um, I found the first photo I took of him and that was in March and it's now October. So I've had my eye on him for a long time. It just wasn't, um, just wasn't, I'm just so relieved that now, like tomorrow is the day he gets off the street and he gets help. He looks terrible, didn't he? He's got like a sore on that leg. Poor thing. And then, oh, those two others, they were very sweet, that young dog. Um, yeah. So I'm doing the best I can. Um, it's Friday. It's about five o'clock. I don't have to work tomorrow. 
um, I am taking a class and then tomorrow's the rescue. So I think I'm gonna say good night for now and I'll see you tomorrow when we put him in the back of the truck and take him to the vet. It's gonna be the greatest thing, really. I hope you enjoy this kind of content because this is my life, basically. I just wanna help all the dogs. Hi everyone, happy Saturday. So you saw what bad shape Max was in yesterday and I'm heading out to get him now. My um, colleague at the volunteer organization is there already, so I gotta run. Uh, we have a vet appointment all set up, so I really hope we can find him and get him in the truck without any issues and um, get him over to vet. So let's go. The sisters, hi chicas, hi chicas, hi girls. So they are scared, they don't know what's going on, but they're gonna go get sterilized. Hi girls. And then the boy, we saw him, but he ran off. So we have a plan to pick him up tomorrow. Okay, so success. Oh, the two girls are in the car on the way to their vet right now. Um, this is a very dangerous road. It's like around a corner that people take really fast and they're always running across the street. So at least we got them. And then the plan, sorry, I'm all out of breath. Um, the, the dog, Max, um, he sleeps in this enclosed area and the lady from the shop is gonna... Um, enclose him in the night so we can come get him in the morning safely. So all is well with that. Oh, I'm so excited. Hi, Max. The girls, the female dogs, are doing well. We're gonna go see how they're doing. And I'm taking Lila, my uh, black lab here, also to the vet. So, we'll see how everyone's doing. So Poor this man, is he's a little sad, huh? He of looks very sad. He's, he's using uh, strong uh, um, painkillers. I give it at the afternoon and that put him like he's in a string it's, uh, it's, um, strong uh, painkillers. He's doing pretty well with three legs, okay? okay. But by now it's not uh, convenient for me and for him to go outside and play a lot. Is that one is pretty new? If if he falls and, and hits in there. Uh, the stitches can be open, and I need to set it again. So. You're good. You're a good boy, Max. So we're gonna change their names. So we'll make the mother Hannah. Okay. The young one is going to be hope. hope. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>